Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here to show you our Costco haul for the last half of June. Lots of goodies here, so let's go ahead and get started. If I sound out of breath, I just unloaded all this <laughs> all, my, my, all by myself. Um, it is hot outside and I am 25 weeks pregnant. So I apologize in advance if I sound out of breath, but let's go ahead and get started because I definitely need to get some of the stuff in the fridge. So to start out, we got a couple bags of this Mega Omega Trail Mix. Um, it was on sale. It was only, I think, $6, $5.99 for um, one bag. So we picked up two. We really like having trail mix on hand just as a quick and easy snack. My husband really likes it to bring to work. So got two bags of that, which is great. And then I got my Kind Bars. I am obsessed with these Kind Bars, you guys. They are so good. And it's just such a great snack for me. Um, they are a wonderful price at Costco. It was $19 for 20 bars, which puts it at a little less than a dollar per bar, which for kind bars is like a really good deal. So picked up some of those. We got a bag of frozen shrimp. We like to put shrimp in um, like stir fry and soups um, just to have on the side. We, we go through shrimp pretty quickly. Um, all three of us in our family really like it. So picked up some of that. We got some plain Greek yogurt. Um, I go through this very quickly. I use it to make homemade pizza dough. I also use it to make pancakes and then I use it as a sour cream substitute. So we go through this pretty quickly and this is a great deal at Costco too. It's organic Greek yogurt um, and it's five dollars and like 89 cents. It's a really good deal for a giant tub of it. And then we got a big old thing of blueberries. These were looking really good. They are currently very expensive in store and we go through berries like crazy. So I went ahead and picked up a big one from Costco because I'll probably turn this into some muffins. Um, we'll use it on yogurt. We'll use it in pancakes, all sorts of things. We love blueberries. So got some of those. Got some more almond butter. This is also a great deal at Costco. It's $7.89 for this giant tub of almond butter. We like putting this in oatmeal, and then I really like to use it um, with apples and bananas like as a snack. And then we picked up some Kerrygold butter, our very favorite butter. This is a great deal at Costco as well, and I swear, once you try Kerrygold butter, you can't go back to like regular butter. It's just not possible. So I picked up some of my daughter's favorite cheese snacks. I wasn't planning to get this, but it, it was in the budget. So she absolutely loves these things. Um, she likes cutting them up and putting them on crackers and she'll eat them like whole and stuff. So got those. Those are a great deal at Costco as well. Feta is like an amazing deal at Costco. It's $7 for this giant tub of feta. And this is pasteurized. Um, I am not allowed while I am pregnant to have cheese that's not pasteurized, but this is. So I picked up some of that. I actually like to put this on my eggs, as weird as that sounds. Um, I usually have like veggie scrambles in the morning and I'll put some feta and some hot sauce on it. And I swear you guys, it's so good. You have to try it if you haven't already. We got five dozen eggs. As per usual, we go through eggs very quickly in our household. I picked up a couple salad mixes. Um, we have this for lunches. So I've got the sweet kale chopped salad, which is my personal favorite. It's got like cranberries and pumpkin seeds and this really good poppy seed dressing. And then I also got this, we haven't tried this yet, but it's a Mediterranean salad kit. So we got some of that and we also got a rotisserie chicken. So what we do with our rotisserie chicken is we pull all the meat off, we shred it, and then we add it to these salads for like quick and easy lunches. We also freeze a bunch of this and use it for like soups, enchiladas, chicken quesadillas, all sorts of things. So we can get quite a bit of meat off of this. Uh, my husband's like a pro <laughs> at getting it off because he used to actually cook these things all the time for Costco. So yeah, picked up a rotisserie chicken, super, super great deal. Uh, Costco does not even make a profit on their rotisserie chickens. So it's $4.99 for this big old chicken and it's delicious. And then I've got some pasta sauce here, just some regular pasta sauce that's already made. Normally I like to make my own pasta sauce in the crock pot, but I was feeling more like I needed convenience <laughs> right now. So I went ahead and picked this up from Costco and this is a great deal too. It's a $8.99 for four jars of this really good 
um, pasta sauce. And then over here was something that we both wanted to try, my husband and I both wanted to try. We've heard really good things about it. It's these coconut almonds with dark chocolate. We figured these would be good for like a little sweet treat if we have a sweet tooth. So we got some of that. Got some avocados because we need avocados every single day. I add avocado to my salad. I add it to my eggs in the morning. Like I'm obsessed with avocados. So is my husband. We go through them like crazy. Um, this was $7 at Costco and I think there's six, six really decent sized avocados in here. So, and then we got some, um, almond milk, unsweetened almond milk. This is a great deal at Costco as well. There's like three cartons of it in there and it's $7.99. So really good deal there. Down there you will see toilet paper. Very exciting. But that's another thing we picked up. And then we got this brown rice and quinoa, like little packets. Um, I'm gonna make what, uh, they're called Buddha bowls. It's on our meal plan for the next two weeks. And basically it's um, like a meatless meal because we try to do meatless Monday. And I'm gonna be doing like a meal plan video for you guys pretty soon just to show you guys like how we meal plan and everything. But um, the Buddha bowls have like this rice and quinoa mix and then some butternut squash, some broccoli, um, some pecans, an egg. Um, you can do like little green onions, all sorts of things. So that sounded really good to me. And so yeah, we picked up this for, again, convenience, because that's, that's what I'm needing these days. And then we've got some cage-free liquid egg whites. We pick this up pretty much every single time we go to Costco because we go through them like crazy. I personally like to mix like a half cup of egg whites with one egg for my egg scrambles in the morning. That's just the way I, I prefer it, so. And then we've got this wild Alaskan marinated salmon because we do fish Fridays. So um, we're gonna alternate. We'll have salmon one Friday and then this tilapia the next Friday. These are both delicious. They're really good, really nicely flavored and really decent ingredients. So yeah, so I got the tortilla crusted tilapia, which is my personal favorite, I love that stuff. And then the wild Alaskan salmon. Honey bunches of oats for cereal. I have been noticing that I get kind of hungry at night now, and a bowl of cereal does the trick for me. Just a little bowl of cereal, I'm able to go to sleep. I cannot go to sleep hungry right now. Like, <laughs> it's impossible for me, so. Um, and my husband really enjoys having cereal as like a late night snack when he gets home from work too, so. Got that, and then we got some granola. This is the pumpkin seed and flax granola. It's my personal favorite granola. I put this on top of yogurt, and I put um, strawberries and blueberries on top of it, and it's delicious. Um, so, and this was on sale. I wanna say it was less than five bucks for this giant box of granola, which is a great deal. These were new at Costco. I have not seen these at Costco before, but I thought these would be really great to have, like, in the event we have a sweet tooth or anything like that. Um, I've had Lenny and Larry's cookies before and they're really good. So, and I thought those would be really good little treats for my husband to bring with him to work too. So we picked up those. It was 15, less than 15 bucks for 20 cookies, which is a good deal I believe for Lenny and Larry's cookies. Cause if I remember correctly, they're pretty pricey. So. And then we got some hash brown potatoes. I really like having this in my egg scrambles. My husband loves them. My daughter is obsessed with hash browns. Like if you ask her what she wants for breakfast, she will always say hash browns or pancakes or both. <laughs> so got some of those. And then lastly, we've got this avocado oil spray. This is $5.99 for two of these avocado oil sprays, which is a really good deal. Um, at our local Kroger, one of these is like that same price. So it's a really good deal. Um, we were down to one and we were kind of running low, so I went ahead and picked up some of that. So that is everything <laughs> that we got from Costco. Lots and lots of goodies, some fun snacks, some fun lunches. Um, I'm excited. And then as far as what we spent, our total was $269.87. Um, 20 of that was pretty much this toilet paper down here. So um, we were right on budget with our food, which was $250. And then I put this $30 of change 
um, back into the household envelope. So our food money is gone, which means that we don't have any money for eating out, but that's kind of just the trade that you make. Like, I didn't have to pick these up. These were not on my list. What else was not on my list? Um, the cheese was not on my list. And I think that was actually it. Everything else was pretty much on my list. So, um, but that's the trade we make is like we get some fun snacks instead of eating out. Um, and lately we haven't really been wanting to eat out anyways. We've been eating at home quite a bit. So that's been really nice. But yeah, guys, so that is pretty much it for this Costco haul. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to catch all of my future videos. If you have any questions, comments at all, let me know in the comment section down below and I will chat with y'all later. Bye.